All right, y'all, so some crazy-ass fucking shit just popped off here at work behind the fucking store, behind the motherfucking building, man. <clears throat> um, Shit just popped off. Shit just got real as fuck, man. So this one drug addict looking, well, he wasn't a drug addict looking motherfucking nigga, but you can definitely tell his ass was up to no fucking good. My nigga came in the motherfucking store, nigga all sweaty, nigga with backpack, nigga with a backpack, and nigga with his fucking hat all turned to the side and shit. And he came in, nigga, with some motherfucking strung out on meth looking ass fucking bitch, right? So <clears throat> me personally, nigga, I got my motherfucking shank on me and shit. You know what I mean, nigga? Some shit gets buck fucking wild, my nigga. I stab a bitch out. I don't give a fuck, nigga. I don't mind killing a motherfucker, you feel me? But, um, yeah, man, so some fucking shit broke out, nigga. I'm about to go take a fucking shit. I'm about to go fucking, you know, use that motherfucking, uh, my nigga, that angel soft shit that this one motherfucker sent me up in the mail yesterday, nigga, from Vons, right? I forgot to show you guys that. But I'm about to go take a fucking shit. And uh, this guy, he's all walking around the store, nigga, with a fucking basket and shit. He, his motherfucker asked me, hey, man, did you see that one girl I was with, man? Like, I can't find her anywhere. I'm looking like, hell no, nah, nigga. It ain't my motherfucking job, nigga, to keep up, nigga, with who and what motherfuckers you come in this goddamn store with. I don't fucking know where that bitch is at. Maybe she's getting fucked in the goddamn bathroom, nigga. Your bitch is getting fucked, nigga, by another goddamn guy. You know what I mean? Maybe my nigga is trying to take care of the motherfucking rent. Shit, she ain't got no job, nigga. Maybe she out here hoeing, nigga, on some prostitution type shit. How the fuck would I know where the bitch is at? But anyways, nigga, long story short, nigga, I go take a fucking shit. And uh, I'm walking to the goddamn front. My homie Rhonda, she's all like, hey, man, real shit, dog. I'm like, yeah, what's going on? Uh, she's all like, uh, we got some weird motherfuckers going on. I'm looking like, nigga, what, what, what the fuck's popping my mind, nigga? What's up? Uh, she's all like, yeah, nigga, there's some weird ass niggas come up in this goddamn store, man. This motherfucker right here that's walking behind Joanne, she just stole, he just stole some shit came back, stole some more shit, and now he's walking around a bit. I'm looking like, all right, cool. So the fucking store I work at, you know, it's connected to fucking um, Joann's and shit. So I walk around the goddamn back, my nigga, about to swoop up and cut this nigga off. And I'm all like, I see the niggas walking over there by some fucking Mexican taco eating truck motherfucking place, right? And I scream out across the lot. I'm looking like, hey, don't bring your ass back, motherfucker. You know what I mean? I'm screaming loud as shit. And then, and then they look at me and shit, right? My nigga start walking up and shit, you know, like I'm, I, I'm guessing like he was expecting me to run like a little bitch. I'm looking like, motherfucker, if I say some shit, you know what I mean? If you walk up to me and want me to repeat it again, I'm going to say it to your fucking face. I'm not some little scared ass pussy motherfucking coward ass bitch that's going to talk shit from afar. But when you roll up on a nigga face to face, nigga, you run like a little fucking coward. You know what I mean? Um... Now, in no shape or form, am I beating up on my chest saying that I'm Mr. Hot Shit? No, I'm not fucking saying that. I'm saying I will fucking defend myself and I will back my fucking shit talk up. You know what I mean? I'm not some motherfucking little, you know, some little scared ass bitch, you know? So anyways, um, shit's getting, nigga, shit get on and fucking cracking. Nigga, he run up in my motherfucking face and shit. He's all like, well, what the fuck did you say, bitch? You ain't nothing but a fucking rent-a-cop. I'm looking like... Bitch, I told you and your motherfucking strung out on meth prostitution looking ass fucking hoe right here. I told you motherfuckers, don't bring your ass back. Bitch, you think I'm blind, nigga? You think me and these motherfuckers have been this goddamn store is blind, nigga? We saw you steal that fucking shit. Nigga, you think we're fucking stupid? Like, come on, nigga, you think we're fucking blind? And I guess this nigga, he gets all like, oh, motherfucker, I ain't take shit. I'm looking like, okay, well then, nigga, if you ain't take shit, nigga, why the fuck? Like, nigga, well, what's all that shit up in your motherfucking back pocket? Fucking brand new ass Calvin Klein motherfucking t-shirts, socks and shit. Nigga, you got a fucking, uh, you got a fucking couple fucking brand new still up in the wrapper fucking earbuds and shit. Still up in the packaging, nigga, with the motherfucking security little spider clasp and shit up on it. You know what I mean? So this nigga pushed me. I push his ass back, nigga. We fucking pushing, nigga. We shit talking. This nigga, I ain't gonna lie, man. My nigga, now, now the shit just got fucking real. You feel me? This nigga, low key, his wife slaps me up in the face. I'm not ready to beat that bitch's ass. You feel me? I don't fucking care if you are a woman, nigga. I'll fuck your shit up. You feel me? So I'm about to roll up on her. I'm about to beat her fucking ass and shit. You know what I mean? Stomp this motherfucking hoe out. And he fucking grabs me and fucking low key. I ain't gonna lie, my nigga low key hit me up in the face and hit me up in the midsection. You know what I mean, nigga? We get down, nigga. I start, nigga, I start fucking swinging like wild as shit, uncontrollably as fuck. You know what I mean? I get this nigga up on the ground. I put this motherfucker up in a stranglehold. You know what I mean? Um, 
if any of you guys are familiar with motherfucking wrestling and shit, dude, um, my favorite wrestler, or one of my favorite wrestlers from WCW, nigga, was fucking Sting, you know what I mean, and I was able to get, I was able to get that motherfucker's neck, I was able to bring him up to his motherfucking feet and put that bitch up in a fucking, like a backwards chokehold, and BAM, plant that motherfucker with the goddamn scorpion death drop, you feel me? And if you guys don't fucking, if you guys don't believe me, nigga, like, here's the motherfucking box right here, nigga, I scorpion death dropped his ass on this fucking broken down ass cardboard box, there it is for you. If you guys can see that shit, that cardboard box is laying right the fuck there, fuck that goddamn shit up, you feel me? But, um... But yeah, man, fuck this motherfucking guy, dude. Like, you know, now, of course, man, uh, I'm going to have to go to the fucking doctor tomorrow, get checked out, all that bullshit, because you know how much. Oh, my God, this, this and that. You feel me, my nigga? I, I mean, I want to fucking I want to sit back. You know what I mean? and be safe as fuck nigga if i got like a sprained ass cheekbone or a sprained ass leg or whatever the fuck may have you you know what i mean shit get real nigga you want to take care of yourself you know what i mean and um but yeah man you know after i fucking after i beat this nigga's ass and shit you, well not beat his ass but after i fucked this shit up i called the police called the cops and shit you know what i mean let them niggas know what's popping and shit and um you know pretty much dude just filled out a fucking little uh, police report, little witness statement, all that bullshit, man, that loss prevention and fucking, well, not loss prevention, but more so what, like, the fucking cops, you know, require you to fill out and shit, you know what I mean, but other than that, man, you know, that's pretty much the fuck about it, you know what I mean, like, I'm not some fucking bitch that's just going to lay down and falter like some scary-ass pussy motherfucker, you know what I mean, like, nigga, if you want to fucking scrap, we can fucking scrap, now, I can't fight worth the shit, I'll fucking tell you that right here, right the fuck now. But, um, nigga, don't think that I'm just going to go out like some little fucking bitch and I'm just going to let you beat my fucking ass. Like, if you're going to beat my ass, nigga, I'm going to fuck you up in the goddamn process, nigga. And that's just the fucking way it is. You feel me?